In just the last couple of weeks, a tornado hit Mesquite and heavy winds tossed a mobile home onto a car. As the severe weather season ramps up, Dallas County today hosted its largest severe weather exercise ever at the county's emergency operations center. Our Aaron Jones was there. This building is where everyone would meet in the case of a natural disaster like a tornado. Today was basically a dress rehearsal for the real thing. In this scenario, an EF4 tornado has hit downtown Dallas. Ten people are dead, hundreds injured. Calls are coming in from across the county. Federal, state, and local agencies are responding like it's the real thing. Today, they focused on addressing challenges seen in previous natural disasters like the 2015 tornadoes that hit North Texas. One of the biggest challenges is getting information out. County officials, the Health and Human Services Department, and the Sheriff's Office plan to really utilize Twitter so the public can be updated in real time. Also, during a natural disaster, everyone wants to help. The county will have someone assigned to organize and give people roles. There will also be someone helping to organize donations from the public. Today, the Dallas County Sheriff says she hears a lot of people say there's no need to worry about these challenges because natural disasters don't happen downtown. This is what she had to say. That's even more so why we need to be planning these type activities because we are complacent and we're saying that they don't happen in a certain area. And so what this exercise today is doing is forcing us to think outside of the box. As everyone prepares here, it was stressed that the public needs to get prepared as well. County officials recommending they get together an emergency preparedness kit and download apps like Twitter so they can stay informed. In Dallas, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News. And